the Ghanaian government has cancelled a convention which hosts Peter Obi in Ghana. Since the Labour Party presidential candidate Peter Grigori Obi lost the Nigerian presidential seat, in some people's idea, he is the only mandate that can help Nigeria to stand firm back again. He since then been receiving invitation to speak at many media houses around African continent. But what led to the Ghanaian government to cancel his invitation to speak in Ghana is questionable. As Peter Obi could not speak in the house he was invited following the cancellation by the Ghanaian government, he just had to leave a brief detail with the news house that followed him up. He said, Imagine what the Nigerian government is doing. Imagine things they consider as budget. Now, Nigerian government has given 5 billion naira to entire tertiary institution as scholarship, as a budget, and 6 billion naira to do a car park for only registrators. And he asks, is this a sort of colonialism? <laughs> he dismissed the saying that white colonial masters are still the problem of Africa. Watch. Failure of leadership. It is failure of African leaders rising up to their responsibility that is keeping Africa where Africa is today. A continent of immense hope and resources. The only way to resuscitate and keep that hope is by having competent leadership. A leadership that means well, that is the only way to make a difference. As long as we continue having wrongly, as long as we continue having incompetent people who don't have capacity, who remain where we can. To change that hope for the youth is to know that it requires sacrifice and everything. We talked about education. Yes, I agree with my dear sister that on the issue of a colonized treatment, whatever I think. But what are the leadership today doing? in terms of investing in those critical areas. I was just talking to Dr. Norman this evening. He said, to me, he told me, yes, it's good when people, and I told them, I do that with you. It's good to blame others for our problem. I don't believe in blaming anyone for my problem. I deal with the problem. We are dealing this evening. In my country, the two this year's budget is we need, if there's anything Nigeria needs, is human capital. Because that's what we drive our HDI. We have very low human capital. In HDI, we are 158 over 180 countries measured. So we need to invest in education. But we are providing for tertiary institutional scholarship. 5 billion in our budget. And we have 6 billion to do car park for legislators. <laughs> is, is that is, is that a fault? Is that a of colonialism? So let's talk about that on this. So this is where we start. We don't have a national library. As a country, the number one country in Africa, a national country. Library was awarded in 1995 and it's being built to today. But our legislators are providing three billion to buy books for their own library. This is not the issue of colonialism. It is the issue I want us to start dealing with our problem. I don't believe that at this stage anybody is the problem of Africa. Except African themselves. And I want the youth to start dealing with the issue head on. And that's where I start. I don't.